guys, what is going on? Derek Sims here, and it's been a hot minute. I hope you guys are doing great. I missed you guys. I hope everything's going okay with you guys in this world. I know everything's going crazy, and it's been rough, but you're doing great, you're sticking in there, and I'm proud of you. And truthfully, keep holding on, because you're fantastic. Each and every one of you guys. Don't forget that. So with this video, I am doing a renovation of Pinecrest Apartments number 404, which is in the new Eco Lifestyles pack. As you can see, we have completely gutted the entire apartment, sold all the furniture, and we are basically furnishing it from the ground up and changing it to something I personally would want to live in. Now for this renovation, we are using just Eco Lifestyles pack and base game content. There is no custom content, there's no other expansion packs used, just Eco Lifestyles and base game content. And I could not be happier with the turnout because truthfully, this is not the first time I've tried to edit this apartment. This is actually, I want to say the third attempt the second or third attempt in the last two weeks. And the reason why is because, as some of you guys have known from my Twitter, I've been having a tough time with my mental health and it's just kind of taking the pits on wanting to record and edit and all that and get inspired to build and create and all that. But I'm slowly coming back. So that's great to share. <laughs> and what's great to share is I'm having a hard time trying to figure out what kind of curtains I want to put in the windows. I want all of them to match, but what sucks is trying to find ones that work for the space. Like, each window is different, and I really wish I could change the windows in this place, but you can't. But it is what it is. So trying to figure out the curtains throughout is kind of difficult, but we make do eventually. I'm not really keen of those little curtains, but... You know, what can you do? You can't really do much, can you? <laughs> so, if you guys remember from right when the video started, or if you even have a Pinecrest Apartment 404 yourself, all the rooms were closed off. What I did was open up the space as it should be and make it more inviting. We have an open concept Oh, how do I say this? An open concept living space. That means the kitchen, the dining room, and the living room is all out in the open. And if I remember correctly too, the kitchen and living room were both closed off. So, I think that is a big improvement in the living space. Just like how we're adding all these nice upgrades. We got a nice sofa, table, generous table at that. And even though it's not really eco-friendly, we're adding a TV because we need entertainment in this place. <laughs> oh, I've been debating this the whole entire build, but obviously you're going to see here in a hot minute that I'm taking out the spindles. I added spindles because I thought it would showcase the space more. I don't know how to really explain it. Especially with those beams that I added in the corners. I think it's a nice touch. Especially when we change the walls here. It took me a hot minute to figure out what kind of wallpaper I want in this area. Like if I wanted it to be different. But since it's all open, I want it to be the same. Same goes for the flooring eventually that you'll see. And picking wallpaper throughout, like in the bedroom too and the bathroom, was kind of challenging. Because I didn't know how I wanted to take that approach. I didn't know how I wanted it to work, especially when you're using only Eagle Lifestyle wallpaper and flooring and not any base content, you know? That part was hard, but I'm still growing to love the options of the walls and the flooring from Eagle Lifestyle. I really wish there was a carpet in Eagle Lifestyles, but say la vie, you just can only get so far so little. <laughs> That's okay. But 
as you can see, our main living space is pretty much good. So we're gonna focus on the bedroom and the bathroom shortly after. Now for a single simoleon, I wanted the space to be inviting and spacious, as we know, because we all love a spacious area. But a big bed for one simoleon wasn't gonna fit. Not with everything I wanted to put in here. A dresser, a table, a mirror, maybe a bookcase. It just wasn't going to work. So we had to be subtle and get a single twin bed. And it works. As you can see, it kind of works for now. <laughs> I kind of wanted to put a plant in there too, but I didn't want anything to block the door. And I really wanted to put a rug in here, but even with BB Move Objects and shrinking it, it wasn't going to work. Again, this is why I want carpet options in Eco Lifestyle, because I would prefer to have carpet than a wood floor in the bedroom, especially if a rug ain't going to work, which kind of sucks, but you know, it is what it is. So creating the bathroom this time around has actually been one of the most enjoyable things I have done in a build because it's actually good and it's working just the way I want it to be. And adding this little room divider, just a plant divider by the toilet, never done that before. I think it's neat and it adds some scenery and greenery to the bathroom. <laughs> right now we're going to be finishing up the build, well I shouldn't say it's a build, it's a remodel. Finish up the remodel with some personal touches such as artwork and other nitty gritties and Hold on, we gotta do BB Move Objects. There we go. <laughs> Terrific. The one thing I really hate about Eco Lifestyles right now, is you can see I just tried putting furniture on the patio. That kind of sucks. I wish we could have like a bench or a lawn chair or something out there. I mean, it's not a place where we can just stand out there and just gaze. We need something to sit on. Oh, well. <laughs> so, that pretty much does it. That pretty much is it for the remodel. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you guys want to download it for yourself, it is up now in the gallery. Link below in the description. And hopefully we can do more remodels in the future. Thank you guys for watching again. This is Derek Sims signing off. And have a fantastic day!